Mmm, a glass of wine I feel. Have I got any kicking about? Perhaps here. Let's have a look. Wine I want. Wine, wine, wine. Not quite what I'm looking for. Ah, that's the sort of thing we need. Austrian wine. Austrian wine, success story of Europe. Come with me. I'll sit a sec. Um, unfortunate place to find that first wine due to Austria's history with antifreeze and winemaking. The scandal of the early 80s where uh, mass production and, and the poorer quality wines led to some um, wine brokers then diluting the wine to give it a little bit more body, a little bit more structure, a little bit more sweetness with antifreeze, which ironically was probably better for you than the alcohol in the wine. Either way, it really affected the Austrian wine industry. It's taken a long time to pick back up, but it has made Austria focus on better quality wines. And they really have become a fashion story of European wines in Austria now. It's a country with small production. A lot of the wines that are made in Austria are consumed by the Austrian public, so we're lucky to see them arrive in Great Britain. Thankfully, Martinez has two, these two beautiful examples. Um, these are the Dot, the Dot wines. There are 51,000 uh, 51, hectares of vineyard in Austria and around the Nieder Osterreich area, the, the, the majority of these are produced. 70% of the wines of Austria are white, such as the Gruner Welt in there, but 30% too for reds. Um, so first, Johnny just asked me to talk to you a little bit about the, the wines uh, from the dot range that we store at Martinez. So the Gruner Veltliner, this is a beautiful, crispy, fresh wine. So, uh, stainless steel tank, five months resting on the leaves. This is citrus, it's herbaceous, with a hint of black pepper on the, the, the palate as you get towards the end. This is gorgeous stuff, it really is. And the red offering, which I'm just having a cheeky glass of just here, the Zweigelt. The Zweigelt. I love the Zweigelt. Such a fun word to say too. Beautiful. Stainless steel tank. 30% um, of which is aged in old barriques. Reblended with flavours of plum, blackberry, cassis, cherry, strawberries. These wines offer superb value, value for money. Uh, this is a crisp, spritey red. Certainly could be enjoyed a little bit chilled as well. And the white, the white certainly gives any Sauvignon Blanc a run for money, in my opinion. At fourteen ninety nine, great wines at Martinez. Find out for yourself. Don't take my word for it. Oh, and by the way, Johnny, can I keep these bottles? See you soon.